the misanthrope as well heard idealist the misanthrope as an idealist can be po a very big possibility when the idealist sees not the world change in the way he wants in the way that he wants the world to be become better it become pessimistic he become disappointed he becomes ashamed of the world and then people are starting to blame him what infuriates the hatred the misanthrope or in this state maybe still the idealist how become pessimistic and is in a st that he can become one misanthrope how more pessimistic he becomes because he see not something improved in his world how much more he will believe that the world will not change and how and more convinced of how evil people are in general the misanthrope is not a violent person the misanthrope is somebody who is without hope somebody who thinks the world is rotten <laughs> and don't confuse that between a psychopath or something like that or a narcissist it is more likely that the narcissist take one persona of a philanthrope and manipulate anybody around him because the narcissist likes the way people are they can easily control them and they don't get so fast targeted because our whole society make it easy for narcissists one out of five CEOs of businesses is narcissist and if you look then to the statics that at least five percent of the population is narcissist and then you can see actually that how higher on the economical ladder the more percent narcissist and the misanthrope sees this all and he sees how rotten the people are he is not hateful he, s he see the world the way it is and he sees it's not a way to change it he is desperate the misanthrope wants to change the world but he sees not a way to do it himself he only can watch how the world become more and more rotten and more and more destructive and how the environment get destroyed how the rainforests get destroyed the misanthrope have a very good observational eye and see that the changes are very easy but the majority of people see not to, to believe him or just are too stubborn to change the misanthrope see the corruption and the errors in the law system but he have not the money or the connections to do something about it the misanthrope is one hurt and disappointed individual he is not 
One angry mob. <laughs> he is not a nasty person. That's the reason he is a misanthrope. Because he don't like the way hominids are. He can't swear away the philotrope. He, li he likes all the drama in the world. The philotrope likes the way people are at this moment. The philanthrope loves all the wars. Now then after that, he can sell a bit of, little bit of his mass amount of money to improve his own ego and his own status. The philanthrope is from right wing or most of the time. He's one person who cares about people because people can make them more money. He's a businessman. Like Bill Gates. He cares about making money. Not about justice. The philanthrope is an amoralist. He cares first and foremost about himself. And secondly about others. And he is happy where he is, can live his life. The misanthrope will, cre will create one world of perfect utopia. You may can say. He wants that not he only himself get it good and get a fair treatment. He will also for the groups who are not represented by society. So this kind of misanthrope is a person like me or Gary Yarovsky or Pat from um, that vegan lawyer. No matter in which time I live, I will always speak up for the victims of hominid and totco humans because that implies that I have to consider you humane. What I not do. Victims. Hominids, they're victims. I care about animals. I don't care about the job of a hitman. And I don't care about the job of a slaughterhouse worker. Same kind of job, if you ask me. I don't care about the job of a 17th century slave owner. Even if I was living in the time. I don't care about the people who work in the child porn industry, even if it be legal in the counters where it is made. Take sides. Neutrality helps the oppressor, not the, fear, not the oppressed. Silence encourages the tormentor, not once the tormented. These are words from Ellie Weasel. Concentration camp a survivor. Open your eyes, blind mortals. When darkness and light become one, the reality splits in a way and the truth become visible.